Well, John, final time, final game. How does it feel? Yeah, look, very, very, very special. Um, it was a nice touch from the from the boys to do that. Then I had no idea. That's why I was a bit, a bit surprised by it. I, didn't, <laughs> I was one of them just wanting to get on, get on with the game and uh, make sure uh, that we didn't uh, do anything strange towards the end of the game. So, no, but as I said, very special moment. It's I've only been at the club obviously a short time. Um, Playing wise, and uh, look, it's, it's a fantastic club, and you can see from the young players as well that started today. Um, there's a positive, positive future for those boys as well. So lots to look forward to for Reading fans. As you touched on there, you've only been at the club for a short time, but you know the reception from the fans and the players it speaks for itself, doesn't it? Yeah, look, as I said, it, it was uh, people were texting me during the week to say it'll be emotional and stuff. I was trying to keep away from that so I could just kind of really soak it all up and enjoy it. And as you said. It's, I've not been here long, but it's a very family orientated club as well, and they made me feel very welcome and my family too, so we're very appreciative of that. And just reflecting on your career, obviously there's a lot to go over, but you must be extremely happy with the career that you've had and, and the experiences as well. Yeah, exactly. Look, to get the chance when I was 17, heading over from Waterford, Ireland, to think that I was going to play the amount of games I did and, and lift the trophies and be involved in the teams that I, that I was. Uh, it was something that I could, could only have dreamed of, so to get the chance to have done that is very special. And so, myself and my family are very proud of. I guess, obviously, the good thing here as well is ended on a high with Reading as well, with, uh, and staying up. Yeah, exactly, and that was the good thing. Thankfully, I was able to get a few minutes towards the end, and uh, as you said, it wasn't the season we were hoping for, but the manager, obviously, when he did come in, we managed to galvanise ourselves and just about do enough to, to stay in the league, but hopefully we'll be at the other end of the table next season. The final question, what's next for John O'Shea? Yeah, hopefully, look, take obviously a little break with my family and then uh, look forward to uh, the next step, hopefully coaching management and uh, let's let's wait and see. Hopefully it'll, I'll be able to jump into something quite quick, but uh, if it doesn't happen, I'll enjoy the break as well and look back on a, on a few years of a career. Congratulations, John. Thank you.